Hey YouTube. Um, in case you don't know, this is the guts of two different JYU Hornets. Yep, they've been through the grinder. They've seen better days. Um, but they're totally within the reach of repair. Just for the most part, not by somebody like me. Anyway, um, last week on Monday, and then two days later on Wednesday, I didn't film it. Well, for one, I didn't want you to know that I'm still getting drones lost in trees. Um, but I got two epic, epic rescues of this JYU Hornet after getting lost in the tree on Monday. I lost visual. I hit the wrong button instead of return to home. I hit like the, the land button and it landed. Just a minute. Hey YouTube, I'm back. I had to stop for a minute. Um, yeah, this is the uh, JYU Hornet. And as you can see, I have sustained some damage. And uh, I was reluctant to buy another body to repair this until I knew I can indeed repair it. Um, as bad as it looks, they were just minor breaks, you know, something snaps, something breaks, um, motor burns, ESC burns, but, you know, my ESCs, I don't think they burn, I think what happens is from the crashes, rough and tumble, the solder points just give, and, uh, they give, and then when I try to repair them, I'm so bad at solder, I think I break things that aren't broken. Or I overheat and I end up burning other circuits on the board. Um, I took this apart and the only thing I could see wrong with it was the motor had actually came off the solder points of the front ESC. So I put three different motors on the ESC and could not get that motor to spin. This is the ESC that came off of the Hornet. The Hornet does not have individual ESCs. It has a clockwise and counterclockwise ESC on one side and the same thing on the other side. So instead of four ESCs, you have two. Or instead of one, like on the XK251, you have two. And this is how they are. And they're fairly easy to mess with, but I'm just a terrible solder guy. So as far as I know, this ESC might be good. But it's just not having a connection and sending a signal to the motor. Anyway, I finally just got frustrated with the whole thing and just took the ESC completely off and figured, let me pull out the ESC of another broken Hornet and swap them. And that's what I did. And... Thank God, all four motors spin. The only thing that doesn't work is the little LED right here does not work. And I'm thinking that's just the plug on the board that came out. And when I take the board off to put it in the new body, it'll work. So hopefully my JYU Hornet will be back in flight in about a month, a couple weeks. And... Uh, It'll look a lot cleaner this time because I'm going to put it back on the Bugs 3 landing gear and put a Wakira gimbal on it with an action cam. All right. Um, oh, you want to see some really, really ugly soldering? This is bad. This is my work. I'm terrible. Now you know I don't like doing this shit. I'm not bad if I had four or five hands, but working with two hands, psh, horrible. But anyway, thank God it does work, so I'm not that pessimistic. I will get another body. The first Hornet probably wasn't too bad either, but now there's missing pieces. I don't even know if you can buy ESCs for Hornets, because I haven't found any. I found boards, I found motors, I haven't found ESCs. So. And now this thing probably has other damage. 
sustained to it to where an ESC probably wouldn't fix it. It needs more than an ESC now. Because I, I broke off some kind of little circuit in here and this little thingy here, I think this is for the... Yeah, it's for the ESC. It goes right here and I don't know how to really put that on there. So. This is a wash, man. It's wrapped, just spare parts. But, um, 200 bucks for a quad? Yeah, I'm, I'm hoping we can repair it. Okay, thanks guys. And, uh, Eddie, my friend that's fixing my Bugs 3s. Thank you so much, bro. We're counting on you, and we're really, really floored um, by your effort. Okay, out. Hey, real quick, YouTube. Um, this is the Rat Rod XKX350. Um... This is the XKX350. This is the XKX350 on a 350 frame or a 330 aftermarket frame. Um, I have been waiting for a motor to come and an ESC to come. So while waiting, I figured I'd put this on this frame. And uh, yeah, now I'm really jonesing, man. I'm tempted to take the motor off of this one and put it on here, but. Motor will be here any day, and let's just hope that that's all it needs, because if that is, then this will be pretty cool. Um, still an XK350. It's going to have uh, Phantom uh, propellers. Um, why am I showing? Oh, the reason I'm showing this is because I want to do the same thing to the Bugs 3. Um, with the exception of Bang Toys X16 ESCs and Bang Toys motors with the original Bugs 3 board on this frame with Phantom props. I think that'll be really cool. I look forward to it. All right, peace, guys. The XK X three fifty rat rod with the bang good frame. Um, I'm kind of toying with the uh, XK X three fifty canopy for my rat rod. Um, the props are going to be white, most likely, because I, I want to use my old Phantom props that I had on my uh, X16. All I need is that one motor, man. Let's see if this works, you know. Um, I'm kind of digging the placement of the ESCs. You can see that. I'm holding the camera. So. And, uh, these white pieces right here are the uh, uh, lids for the LEDs on the Bug 3. Um, I kind of glued these to the side, so that the side of the top of the frame um, to sort of work as a makeshift handle. See, I can pick it up from here. You don't have to worry about messing with the ESCs because the ESCs kind of hang over and sort of they'll be all like they'll, they'll look like this sort of when it's done. And I just have to do this last one. And the, and, uh, the LEDs are on the bottom. I use the bars from the 350. And I use the lens cover for the 350. And uh, yeah. resale. I glued the little piece off the thing on the back of the frame. Resale will go in there. And as far as the camera, I'm not really tripping off that right now because I have another. This is my XK3 X350 with the run cam on 
top of it. And, um, well, I'll be honest with you, I have a third XKX350. And, uh, that XKX X350 is going to have these for the landing gear. I guess these are tarantulas. These are Phantom 3 landing gears, I assume. Anyway, the XKX350 is going to have these for landing gear. And, uh,. Wakira gimbal with the camera, whatever I use, and the Bugs 3 is going to be in a frame like this. I already mentioned that. And another Bugs 3 is going to, well, no, my uh, my JYU Hornet is going to have, well, it did have, but now it's got to be a build again. It's going to have Bugs 3 landing gear with the same gimbal, the Wakira gimbal on the JYU Hornet. Alright, I'll talk to you later. I don't know.